We begin with breaking news out of Colorado. A sheriff's deputy there has been killed and four other deputies have been wounded after a gunman opened fire in an apartment complex in a Denver suburb. Two residents were also shot and according to the sheriff's office, the suspect was shot and is believed to be dead. As the body of the deputy was taken from the hospital, officers held a procession. CNN's Scott McLean is there. Scott, how did all of this go down? Yeah, Boris, we know very little about what happened, but we are starting to learn bits and pieces. We know that a lot of residents in this condo complex, there are about maybe 15 to 20 buildings in this area. Each are two story walk ups with four suites in each. We know that many people awoke to the sound of gunfire, though this is a pretty sleepy corner of suburban Denver. And so for many people, it wasn't clear what it was. One person said it may have sounded like firecrackers. Another told me uh, that it sounded perhaps like heavy construction that had been going on nearby. But as we know now, it was gunfire. One woman who lives in that complex, just a few buildings away, uh, told me that she believed that the shooting lasted between 30 seconds and one minute. She said it was quite intense uh, and that it sounded like an exchange, meaning there were multiple weapons being fired at the same time. What exactly sparked this or what transpired in terms of details is unclear, but we know that sheriff's deputies say that they were responding to some sort of a domestic disturbance. All told, five deputies were shot, one was killed, that body was taken in that procession to the local coroner's office. There were also two civilians who were killed, and we can tell you that we know that three people have been released from the hospital, though we don't know uh, how many of those are, are civilians and how many of those are deputies. Uh, the suspect in this case has been killed. There is no longer a threat to this area. The president, Donald Trump, is also tweeting his condolences, writing, my deepest condolences to the victims of the terrible shooting in Douglas County, Douglas County Sheriff and their families. We love our police and law enforcement. God bless them. And Boris, one other thing that we've learned is that uh, the Boulder County Sheriff, another area of suburban Denver, uh, his son was among the deputies here in Douglas County uh, who was wounded in this incident. Uh, we should be able to get more details. There is a press conference uh, starting here uh, momentarily.